Hey guys, DSP Fishing in another video. In this video, we're catching trout with spinners. We're at a catch and release area with a ton of trout around me. And I'm using a nine, number 9 Panther Martin spinner. I'm on the dock with a load of trout. A trout right here, actually. Um, and we're going to catch fish on this catch, so stay tuned. Yep, there he is. That's simple, guys. That's simple. This is a little guy, but we're going to get him back and hopefully get some bigger ones, so stay tuned. There he goes. Stay tuned, guys. This is going to be a very epic video. Alright guys, triple up. I'm on a fish. Dan, Dan's got a fish. Damien's got a fish. Today is March 24th. I'm here at Sed Lake. It's March 24th. You can fish this right now. Um, catch and release only. Nobody's on the water right now. As you can see, it's about 12 o'clock. Um, it's just rained. But just when this rain stopped, I'm catching a ton of fish. I probably got 20 or 30 in the last <laughs> 45 minutes. Um, so we're catching fish. So stay tuned for the video. Ooh, that's a good one. Got a measurement on this guy, about 12 inches, as you can see right there. Uh, picked him a little bit in the face there, but we're gonna get him out. No problem. About 12 inch brown trout. Goes back in the water, just like that. Let's get some more. put this guy back and get some more stay tuned all right guys before the video progresses any further i wanted to showcase the techniques and gear utilized in these two evenings of fishing the main technique involved the simple spinning rod setup i was using a loose speed stick with eight pound fluorocarbon spooled on i either used a number nine panther martin spinner that in the gold color or a white rooster tail to catch all these fish when we were fly fishing the rods were tipped with 3x tippet and had various streamer patterns varying in color. These particular fish in this lake were cruising right around and underneath these dock pilings waiting to ambush any sort of prey that they could get their mouths on. These fish would be suspended in about two feet above the bottom of the lake. The depth of the lake was five feet deep. Our spinners just so happened to be cruising just in below the middle of the water column, putting it right in line with these fish. So with that in mind, I hope you guys can enjoy the video. Beauty. Fish after fish after fish. colors. What a beautiful fish. Here he goes. We'll let him go. He's pretty feisty. That's a good 15, 16 incher. So we're going to get some more. Stay tuned. Alright guys, we're here. This is day two. Uh, yesterday I caught upwards of 100 fish 
plus. <laughs> Dan doesn't believe me. Uh, we're probably gonna catch nothing seeing as I'm gonna look like the biggest liar in the world. But we have Dan right behind me and then we have Damien, who this is his first uh, introduction onto the channel. So we're gonna see if we can catch him fish. Andrew said he might come too, so. Hopefully not. <laughs> you can edit that out. Yeah, well, I'm editing a lot of this, so. <laughs> So stay tuned for the video, it was already a great trip yesterday and today I have the actual camera with me so we should get some good b-roll as well. So stay tuned, uh, it's going to be a great video. Back at the same spot, uh, I actually already did test cast and caught a fish so we know there's some fish still here. Um, got Damon behind us and Dan's over there putzing around. Um, but. Uh, Dan doesn't know how to fish, so it, it doesn't matter. <laughs> it, do, it doesn't matter if he, what he ties on. So uh, we're gonna see if we can catch some more. I'm sure we'll get some uh, by the end of the day. So stay tuned. Let's get some more. Dan's on to a fish. I think it's a brook trout. Looks like a brook trout. Beauty. It's about the average size hey, trout we're, we've been catching here. Yeah. Anything else to say about that catch, Dan? Easy catch and release. Absolutely. Beautiful. Uh, I think he's chilling right there. Let's get some more. Alright, Damien's first fish at uh, Lake X. Damien, do you have anything to say to the camera about your amazing catch? This is uh, my first fish on the fly rod. Well, my first trout, anyway. I'm going to put them up over here. Well. <laughs> anything else to say? Well, he's under the dock now. And Dan's got another fish over there. I'm going to try to film this. I'm not even going to have a chance to fish. <laughs> Pulling in. Inch wiener Magoo. There's the bum himself. Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot, there's a lot of people from the hood over here. Lots of bass streamers. I thought maybe we'll try and catch some on a streamer. I saw Dan catching them on the pink. Maybe we'll give that little guy a shot. Well, let's get on them. Oh, you want to it? You want it? Yeah. Oh, oh, you got it. <laughs> Woo! 
looking for a bubble fish. Then Dan's got a fish. Dan's got a fish. I got one on the dry fly. Mine's a good sized one. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, I think this was one of my greatest fishing videos that I've made. Um, it is. It was hard to make because I had over an hour and 40 minutes of filming time because we caught so many fish. Speaking of that, if you guys can guess how many fish we caught, like generally, approximately, within, within 10 fish, um, if you can guess that, you can give me your Instagram and uh, I'll DM you. The exact spot where we were um, the only the the first person that posts um, the right answer within 10 will get the uh, the location um, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video it was an awesome uh, time fishing with friends and um, at an awesome location catching so many fish uh, it was it was to the point where my back was hurting so <laughs> uh, yeah I I had a great time slow little bit my friends I'll see you on the flip side. Yeah, they they fight Get ten times harder. Away from me, all three of you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to I am. We're going in the water. Get back, Kevin. Get away from me. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> yeah, you're gonna be the one that first. Andrew lost his bait, which I'm holding on to. So now he's gonna strip and get in the water to retrieve his lure. And all the fish are sitting right there, so Andrew's gonna spook all of them and ruin the fishing for everybody else. So. Yeah, it's got a fish. Because Andrew is uh, spooking all the fish. I'm scaring him that way. You were on like a two inch stick. <laughs> Jeez Louise, Andrew.